GMB. Welcome to Houston, the bottom of the south. If you ain't from around here, you might not make it out. I done seen it all. Plenty bowed and foul. One day buying the mall, next day lost it all. Don't let the hype fool you. Keep the two close by. Two close These jackets will play cool and hit you with the four five. What's up, YouTube? This is Rob here, YouTube the Budget. Back with another video. Guys, I'm up early, early in the morning. I'm about to do a camera system install in my neighbor's house. He's not up yet, so I'm about to go wake him up. Oh yeah, oh my god, you hear this cricket? <laughs> so that cricket is somewhere in there. Can y'all see it? Can y'all see it? Well, it's somewhere in there. So I'm about to do a camera install. On my neighbor's house right there. Right there. So I'm gonna be interesting. It's gonna be kinda of easy because it's a actual one story, so put my ladder, that's all the way around. So I had to go all the way around to get my ladder because it's on the other side. Well, I could have get it right there, but it's just too tight. So I have cameras on my house. See right there, that's one. Then I got one in the garage over there. Then I got one right there. So I have a total of nine cameras in my house. So basically, I'm gonna do the same thing for his. He's gonna have, I think a total of six or maybe seven. I'm not mistaken. I can't remember. Oh my god, look at this backyard. I need to cut this too before I go on vacation. But yeah, so that was one, two, three right there, right? Look. Another camera right there. Another camera right there, as you can see. So how many is that? That's four or five. Another camera right there. That's six. Another camera right there. That's seven. And I got two more inside the house. So I have basically a whole 360 of cameras. I got a total of nine cameras. Got a 360 camera so I know at every access point somebody's trying to get in my house and of course you got to have a launch system so but you never could be sure but a lot of people get i don't know if y'all can hear that water man a lot of people get camera systems confused what's the purpose of it it's not going to stop a thief from breaking into your house or anything it's just reinsurance, like, if somebody do break in your house, what they take, can you get your license plate, or well, their license plate, et cetera, et cetera. But you still need a alarm system. A lot of people fail to realize that you, uh, they fail to realize that you still need a alarm system. You have to get an alarm system regardless because there's no point of cameras if you're not aware of somebody's breaking in your house. So, that's just how I feel about it. Um, but yeah, let's get into the camera system. And I'm about to wake his ass up. So I got all my stuff right here. The ladder right there. I got my drill and my stink and stuff and my little pink chair right there. So I'm gonna ring his doorbell like crazy. Hear the dogs. He gonna be mad. <laughs> All right, guys. So let me get. I guess let me get the rest of my stuff, and I'll holler at y'all when I come back. All right. Whew. So I got all the cameras ran, but I actually made a major mistake. Um, hold on. One thing about doing stuff in the attic, guys, that installation, you you try try not to inhale so much 
because the installation is so it's not healthy for you basically so all the cameras are ran but i messed up on one camera um so as you can see right here it clearly says two camera i don't know what you call this thing a female or a male but it's supposed to have the little ding -a -ling thing right here private part or whatever and on one of the cameras I didn't do that on and it was the hardest camera to run so now I have to go back in the attic and redo this one because if I don't they won't have a camera right here so you remember that little thing I was telling you about see that supposed to go into the DVR um, it's supposed to go in the DVR but I wasn't it was, I was so intrigued on trying to get it done because of the spot it was in like you know what let me just show you right now I videotaped it on my cell phone I just show you how tight it was and how tough it is right about here all right guys so I'm currently that so this is by far the hardest one I know I have to do if you can see look at the area I'm in so what I'm gonna do I'll put the installation back So I have to crawl back. Yeah. Look at my face. This is how tight this area is. These are the wires. Yep, so that small area is where I was at. And that's not it. <clears throat> so this is what I gotta get over. So I'm 6'1 guys. 220. I'm tripping. 230. Uh but 220 was my old weight. But this is what I have to get in without. So let me throw the, the wires this way. So, so I'll show you when I get out how hard it was. So y'all understand where I'm coming from now. But the rest of the cameras, guys, is ran. So all I had to do was connect the cameras to all the wires, drill them up in this spot, and then run them to the actual hub. And I'm gonna show you a picture of my hub in my house to give you a picture, an idea of what I'm doing to their house as well. So check this out. So what y'all think about that? So. They don't have an entertainment system like me because on top of mine, it was the the actual uh, DVR. Then I had my entertainment system because that room is a media room. I convert to a media room. So I want to finish doing everything. But let me show you how I actually ran the wires so I can give you an idea of the last one I ran the back. Oh, that was a B. So you can have an understanding of what I did. Oh, 
is hot. What you got gloves on for? <laughs> you pulled it down already? So, oh, pull it. Oh, no, no, no. Wow, Jayla, really? I didn't want to break anything. That's my lovely assistant right there. So, all you do is basically drill a hole. You got to use a snake. This is your best friend. And you just use electrical tape to make sure it comes down. Don't put the two connections together. You have to split them up so you don't have to drill a big old hole. As you can see right there, and you just pull it down. That's simple. So when I finish with the product, I'll let you know. Like I said, I'm not gonna let you see the whole house because they have some secret cameras. <laughs> but I have to do the one in the front over. So unfortunately, I gotta get back in the tiny hole. All right, guys. I'm not gonna show y'all everything because I'm just exhausted. But I'm going out of town this week, so I couldn't finish, but let me show you what we have. So, as you see, seven cameras, they have eight channels, so they're going to hold it. Well, I broke the wire, so you can't use the last wire, because I yanked it out of the hole. Um, so, I have extra wire. I have two extra wires, by the way. Um, so, when they figure out what they want to do with the eight, cha the eight channel, they can do that, or just keep the... Uh, actual extra camera for wherever they need but as you can see I need to do a review on that BMW don't y'all think um, but that's pretty much it guys is that simple um, comment below if you stay in the Houston area I will hook yours up for you um, but it'll be a pricey fee it ain't cheap and it took me all day to do it but it's okay but finished as you can see, everything is right here. I'm going to do a floating wall, a floating mount like I did mine. Picture's going to be here so you can see it. So yeah, it's going to be just like that. Patch the hole, put the power underneath. And that's the end of the day. This is Robert U2 on the budget. Peace. She helped me today. She put in work, so I owe her some money. Peace, guys. Tell me what y'all think. Comment below.